Well, ever since the search began, viewers have been asking us why South Dakota did not issue an Amber Alert. Serenity Denard's disappearance does not meet that criteria. Kel Lansdan Santella joins us with a look at the options in a situation like this and how you can get an email the next time a child disappears. Dan? Well, Sammy, here's a look at the four things needed to issue an Amber Alert. First, law enforcement must be involved. There also needs to be evidence that a child under 18 is in danger. In this case, Serenity Denard isn't dressed for the cold, and she's been missing since Monday morning. Authorities couldn't issue an Amber Alert because there is no evidence she was kidnapped. Authorities tell us she left on her own. Because of that, they also don't have witness information describing a car or a suspect who may be involved. Now, when a disappearance doesn't meet the Amber Alert criteria, authorities can issue an endangered missing advisory. An advisory can be issued for missing children and people of all ages who may be in danger. Authorities just need to have an idea of where that person may be. Now, in both cases, authorities try to get out the information as quickly as possible. One way they do that is through alerts. If you're interested in signing up to get an email the next time there's a missing person in South Dakota, just go to Kelloland.com. Click on the Endangered Missing Advisory Story, and you'll find the link. All right, thanks a lot, Dan. Now, if you have seen Serenity or have any information about where she might be, please call the Pennington County Sheriff's Office. That number is 605-394-6115. Now for a 